Here is a timeline of all of his suspected robberies. Starting in April, Pritchard police had these on their radar after he allegedly went to the Family Dollar on North Wilson Avenue. When he arrived, he fired a shot in the store and demanded money, but nothing was taken, according to Pritchard police. Weeks later, on May 8th, police say he went back to the store and did the same thing again, but left with money from the cashier. Here is a picture of him from that incident. His alleged spree continued on June 14th, where he reportedly committed two armed robberies the same night. The first one at 930. Daphne police say it is a high probability that Dees is the suspect in the robbery at the Exxon gas station on Highway 98. This surveillance video shows the suspect running into the store, pointing a gun at the cashier demanding money. He fires one shot, startling the cashier, who was too scared to hand the money over. He then runs out empty-handed. The second robbery on the other side of the Mobile Bay a little after 11 p.m. Mobile police began to investigate after Dees reportedly went into the Waffle House on Spring Hill Avenue. Mobile police provided these pictures of him in the Waffle House. MPD says when he arrived, he demanded money from the register and fired one shot in the air. After firing his gun, he ran out with money and went inside this getaway car you can see on your screen. And Thursday night, Pritchard police say Dees robbed the Dollar General on Lot Road near St. Stephen's Road. Pritchard police provided us this video of Dees allegedly entering the store. Police say he fires a shot in the air, argues with the cashier, and demands money. The cashier opens the register, and the suspect gets behind the counter and takes the money and runs out the door. Pritchard police say he left with close to $700. No one in the robberies were injured. Reporting in Mobile County, Jeremy Jones, WKRG News 5.